What is happening, everybody? Tonight is Christmas Eve, and oh boy, I'm really excited. Tomorrow is Christmas. It's practically here. Hope you don't mind my Grinch impression. I thought it would be perfect, the perfect opportunity for me to voice as the Grinch. But yeah, really awesome. Tonight is Christmas Eve, and tomorrow is officially Christmas Day. Like I said, I'm really excited. I'm already festive up. Fested up, that's what I should say. I'm all dressed up, festive style, in spirit, yes. Christmas spirit never dies out. So I am going to be showing you the stuff that we have in the house, like all the Christmas decorations and everything, the Christmas tree, the wreath, stockings, and more. So everyone, I hope you all enjoy. So check this out right here. Here is our Christmas tree. And oh boy, doesn't it look magical. It's all lit up with full of decorations, as you can see. And as you can also see on the bottom right here, the bottom of the Christmas tree, it's ready to be filled with presents by Santa Claus. And yeah, I'm really excited. Like I said, I'm really excited for Christmas Eve. Tonight is Christmas Eve, and tomorrow is Christmas Day. So here's the tree right here. I'm going to give you a full 360 of it. Check it out right here. It's full of decorations and lights and everything. Honestly, everything in my house right here, all the decorations and stuff, it looks magical in here. All the lights and decorations and stuff, amazing stuff right there in my opinion. And check this out. I also have my Star Wars stocking bag or the bag that's shaped like a stocking right here. I got this from Dollar Tree a year ago, I think. And yes, I still use this today. And check it out, it's even, it's even a two-in-one. So it's a bag, and it can also be used as a stocking. Oh, it's a party tote bag, which is what it's called right here. I still have the tag right here, so really awesome. And you can see Darth Vader and Yoda. Darth Vader's lightsaber, like a candy cane, more candy canes, the Jedi Order symbols on the Christmas balls, and the Empire symbols on, right, on top right here. Stars, TIE Fighters, and another lightsaber, that's just, this is Yoda's lightsaber, which looks like a green candy cane, and a gingerbread, a gingerbread man that looks like C-3PO. That's really awesome. Really, really cool. I really love having this stocking bag right here, or the t party tote bag is what it's called. I like to call this a stocking bag because, hey, it's shaped like a stocking. Amazing stuff. So back to the tree right here. Check this out right here. Really, really beautiful. And as I show you the other side right here, look at this. Amazing, in my opinion. I think we did a really good job. Once again, a really good job with Christmas this year. With all the decorations and setting things up. A real good job. Really good job that we did. And right here, you can see these are some paper mittens that I made many years ago. I think I made this in elementary school. But yes, we still use these today for the decorations. For hanging up the decorations, that is. We still use them. And yeah, really. Takes me back. Really nice. So yeah, look at this. Back to the tree. Here's what it looks like behind it. Look at that. Really, really beautiful. Yeah, it's a tight squeeze right here. And we even decorated the cuckoo clock as well. Check this out. We have Santa Claus on top. We have some, we have some of this tinsel right here. We got a teddy bear. Oh, by the way, these aren't decorations. These are already on the cuckoo clock. But the teddy bear, Santa Claus, the tinsel right here, and the snowman and the teddy bear, those are all the decorations that we used to decorate the cuckoo clock. Dad thought it was a really good idea to do that, so really awesome. And yeah, really awesome tree, if I say so myself. Wow, amazing stuff. Really magical, like I said. 
all lit up, just like the rest of the Christmas spirit. So here we have the Christmas wreath. And check this out. I think I did a really good job decorating it. Looks really beautiful. Chose really good spots too, as you can see. Hey, what you doing staring there? Stand in the front. There you go. Look at that. That's better. Yes, really amazing job I did. And in case you're wondering about the flashing lights in the background, or at the window right here, yes, that is my Christmas hat. So yeah, I thought turning on my Christmas hat with the lights would fit in really nicely now. You know, getting in the Christmas spirit, keeping it shining bright, especially during this crazy year. But yeah, awesome, awesome. Love the Christmas wreath. And taking a look over here, of course, we have the Merry Christmas sign right here, along with more tinsel. Really awesome. And yes, there's the Monsters Cuckoo Clock right there. Yes, d this is Dad's Monsters, Monsters Cuckoo Clock. And it, and it was really a good idea decorating around it, too. Amazing. You can see right there, Santa Claus and the Snowman. Merry Christmas. So yeah, beautiful, beautiful stuff. So there's a Christmas wreath and there's the Christmas tree too. And look over here. Here is another wreath. <laughs> this is actually, this was actually a handmade wreath right here. It's not like the wreath with the, it's not like that wreath. This is another wreath that I made in elementary school and hey it still takes me back i think i still did a really good job back then and i still think this today too amazing stuff yeah having stuff having the christmas artwork that i have decorated for christmas it really brings me back many memories so next up right here we have a peanuts christmas uh globe right here or a light up globe you can see right there, Happy Holidays right there. Really nicely embossed there. And you can see the globe itself lighting up really brightly. It's, it's, it's a really bright light, as you can see. And you can see different characters, too. Uh, you can see a Christmas tree right there. You can see Lucy, a snowman, Snoopy. Who else? You can see Merry Christmas right there. You can see Sally as well, a Christmas wreath. And good old Charlie Brown, of course, himself. And yeah, really awesome globe, if I say so myself. And of course, we decorated around the fish tank as well. We have some nutcrackers. We have a Santa Claus nutcracker, and we have a knight nutcracker, or a soldier nutcracker. We have some lights and tinsel all around, as you can see. Of course, the fish food is in on... The fish food is not included with uh, Christmas decorations, but hey, it is, of course, very useful for the fish when they want to eat. And of course, you have the snowmen. You have a lot of snowmen. And it looks like they're having fun on a sleigh. Perfect. And of course, yes, we can see Santa Claus and the Grinch. Oh boy. <laughs> Don't I look amazing, Santa? Oh, yeah. <laughs> awesome stuff. I really thought this was a really good idea. Putting the Grinch and Santa Claus together. Ho, 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 ho. What are you doing here, Grinch? I hope you haven't come to steal Christmas again. <laughs> yeah. I don't think the Grinch is going to steal Christmas this year. Of course, we remember he learned his lesson after that, right? But yeah, you can see a Merry Christmas pickup truck here, too. You have a dog right there, a black dog. Right here. Really cute. A really cute dog. And of course, we have Christmas trees in the back, too. Really nice. And of course, more tinsel. And the snow. It's a snow-like fabric right here. No, it doesn't feel like snow, but the fabric right here, the soft fabric, is supposed to look like snow. Really cool. Really think this was a really good idea right here to lighten the mood up for Christmas. Of course, we have Christmas Town right here, too. All lit up, all the houses, the fire station, bakery, town hall, toy shop, post office, a hotel, school. Uh, I, think that, I think that's a church, if I'm correct. Of course, we have the pet shop. 
and we have a house. And look at this fabric right here. You can see Santa himself along with the other elves. And I think this is Santa Claus's workshop too. You can see a Christmas tree in the background there and all the toys, the fireplace. Yeah, this is a really beautiful fabric right here. And of course, it is also supposed to be snow as well. Check that out. Awesome stuff. And of course, as we move on over here, you can see this light up, this lit up town right here. You see there's the park theater and the toy shop. You can see all the different people right there. And you have the teddy bears, toys for tots. Yes, I fully support that. Yes, yes. Toys for tots, that's a win right there. You can see all the toys in there. And the two teddy bears, or the two bears right there, pulling the wagon, which is full of toys. And there's Santa Claus right there. And of course, there's a picture of me. <laughs> and you can see Santa Claus with his reindeer. Amazing. Oh, and this is, this is the bakery right here. I didn't know this was a bakery until I saw this sign right here. Amazing. Yeah, this is really beautiful. And of course, this also plays music too. Let me see if I can get behind here. The switch. There we go. Yes, it plays different types of Christmas music. So that's really amazing. Perfect way to light things up. It looks beautiful over here. What do you think, guys? Yeah, amazing. Just because it's a crazy year doesn't mean it's going to spoil my Christmas. That is for sure. As we let this Christmas town right here play the songs. Check out the stockings right here. Of course, we can't forget about these stockings. Oh, and look at this right here. We have a train right here, a candy train, which of course was a gift. Beautiful, beautiful. I love this train. Thought it would be perfect to add in it as an addition to all the rest of the Christmas stuff we have. Let me stand up the snowman right here. I think this is another type of candy right here. Yeah, he's holding a Christmas tree lollipop. There we go. That should do it. And you can see Mr. Goodbar there too. There we go. And you can see also there's Santa Claus. You can see the raisins and the candy canes and the chocolate. And it looks like his sleigh too. Really amazing. And I love this train too. I instantly loved the train ever since I got it. It was actually, remember when I said that the train was a gift? A Christmas gift, I should say. This was a gift. The Mr. Goodbar there, along with that piece of candy right there too. The snowman, Santa Claus, his sleigh, the rest of the candy. And of course, I think this is supposed to be Rudolph too, because you can see the red nose right there. And I think these spirals right here, these right here, they're supposed to represent his horns, I think. Beautiful. And of course, you can see the googly eyes too. It looks so cute. But yeah, I think it's supposed to be Rudolph, the red nosed reindeer, of course. And you can see there's some chocolate there. I think all of this right here were gifts. They were actually my first Christmas gifts that I got this year. One of the few, actually. So, really awesome. And you can see there's some Ferrero Rocher. Ferrero, Ferrero Rocher hazelnut chocolates. I wanted to say the name in a fancy tone. <laughs> but yeah, beautiful. I love... I love these hazelnut chocolates. They're perfect to have as desserts, especially during the holiday season. Oh, I also can't forget my M&M's wand fitting in with all these goodies right here. Really awesome. Very spectacular, if I say so myself. I got the M&M's wand a year ago for Christmas, and I still enjoy it to this day. I really love this wand. And hey, I thought I would put it right here to fit along with the rest of these goodies. Now, how sweet it is. And of course, here are the stockings, and as you can see, the stockings are already filled up. Hmm, interesting. Has Santa Claus and the elves, have they already filled up the stockings already? You know, getting everything set for Christmas? Hmm, I don't know. 
But yes, they are stuffed, as you can see. But what do you guys think? How did they get stuffed? Hmm. <laughs> but yeah, you can see. Yes, this is my. That's my dad's stocking. That's my mom's. Of course, here's my stocking right here. The big white one right here. The big white stocking. And yeah, I'm surprised that they're still here. The, these stockings are really old. But the, these two stockings, they're not old at all. And they're actually for my dogs. How cute is that? Yes, we did get um, a few years ago. A few years ago before Christmas, during December, we got the dogs their own stockings. We got Bentley his stocking. And we got Roxy's stocking. And they're also stuffed too. I wonder what's inside there. I wonder what's inside my stocking as well. Well, the only way to find out is to wait until tomorrow, which I can't wait for, by the way. I mean, yeah, beautiful stuff. Speaking of the dogs' stockings, hmm, I'm going to go ask my two dogs if they're excited for Christmas this year. Hey, Roxy girl, are you excited for Christmas this year? You know your stocking is all filled up up there? Your stocking's already filled up. What do you think it's inside there? Do you know? Well, the only way to find out, of course, is to wait until tomorrow. But yes, your stocking is already filled up. I think, I think you're going to enjoy what you have in your stocking. What do you think? You're excited? Me too. Hey, Bentley. How you doing? Are you excited for Christmas? I think he is. I think, well, besides Bentley just fighting to stay awake, I think he's going to be really happy for what he's going to get in his stocking. You know, your stocking's already filled as well. Your stocking is already filled. Are you excited? <laughs> Little Bentley's fighting to stay awake, but yes, he is excited. He is very excited for Christmas this year, just like I am. So I hope you all enjoyed my video, as you saw with me asking Roxy and Bentley if they were excited for Christmas this year. Besides them falling asleep, hey, I'm sure they are just as excited for Christmas as much as I am. And hey, I thought because of my hat uh, lighting up, I thought I would fit in right here with the Christmas tree, the wreath, and everything else in the stockings, all the lights and decorations. Hey, I thought I would look very spectacular with everything else here for my Christmas spirit to keep lighting up my way. So yeah, I hope you all enjoyed my video. Remember to smash that like button and be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Tell me in the comments below, are all of you excited for Christmas this year? Because I sure am. And I'm sure everyone else is too. Tonight's Christmas Eve and tomorrow will be Christmas Day. So this is me wishing you all a happy and safe holiday. Merry Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas to you. Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night. Merry Christmas and a happy new year. However you want to say it. Merry Christmas everyone.